Hey everybody, welcome back to another video tour here at the BitBlock for Super Smash Bros. on the Nintendo 3DS. My name is Josh Thomas, and today we are going to be checking out the Target Blast mode, which is a brand new bo uh, brand new mode, never before seen in Smash Bros. history. A little bit like um, Home Run Contest, mixed with Break the Targets. So, it's pretty cool, and something that I've been failing at a lot, so hopefully I can redeem myself here in, a, in an actual video. Uh, who do we want to go with? I'm going to go with Kirby, but not regular Kirby. we got to go with, let's see, there it is, Weird Shadowy Kirby. I love it. All right, let's see what we can do here. So the basic goal is you want to bash the heck out of a bomb and send it flying into a pit of junk over there. You can pause to see, uh, and you want to break all that stuff. Just basically demolish things with a giant bomb before it goes off in your face. Let's do this. You want to keep beating it to get percentage? Oh, that's not good. All right, here we go. Let's send it. You don't have to get a huge percentage because, you know, it's going to be... It's going to vary depending on where you hit it. Oh, that was pretty good. I think for the most part, what you want to do here is you want to work your way from the top to the bottom. Now, there are two rounds, so here's our second round. Let's clean that up. A mallet to the bomb's face, assuming it had one. You can also... This is kind of a cool strategy... You can hit it up against the wall there and bounce it off, which is sometimes good. And there, it really wasn't. It didn't really do me much good. Oh, it did me a lot of good because we just got an R-Wing trophy. I'll happily take that. That was a new record. Again, happily take it. Let's, um, let's try it one more time with Dark Shadow Kirby and then we'll switch characters here. You can also save your replays. So if you got an amazing, you know, high score and you wanted to share that with friends, you can, of course, do that as well. There we go. So that was kind of a wimpy hit, but you know what? might pay off in the end. There we go. Taking the bottom out. That's the way I do it. Yeah, see, I'm doing the opposite of what you're actually probably supposed to do. In my experience, it is better to start from the top and let stuff topple down. All right, round two. Let's do this, Kirby. All right, I think it's ready to go. There we go. That was awful, as you probably can see. <laughs> All right. Let's retire Kirby and uh, check out a different character. Although that color swap, I think everybody would agree, is pretty magical. Actually, I think that's from uh, Kirby Triple Deluxe. I could be wrong there, but I remember seeing some weird shadow Kirbys in that game, I believe. Should we try, um, let's go with Little Mac. Change up his colors. There we go. Little Mac in his famous pink sweatsuit. I wish I had one of those of my own. It's kind of funny when you don't hit the bomb in time and it just blows up in your face. I don't, I'm, I'm not going to purposely demonstrate that for you guys, but it might happen by accident. All right, let's, uh, let's send her flying. That's pretty much middle ground there. There, as you can see, are various things in this structure that you want to aim for. Uh, there are bombs, little bomb blocks. If you hit one of those, it's going to cause a chain reaction. That's really what you're going for. Also, in the bottom right corner, you can see that little wrench. That would be um, some more power-ups you can get, and then you can customize your Miis and characters with those. So, yeah, a lot of, a lot of good stuff to aim for there. There we go. Oh, that awful. I'm doing even worse than usual here. I you see, if, what is that? Oh, that's a Kirby. I'm pretty sure that's a new move for Kirby because obviously Super Smash Brothers for 3DS and Wii U is all about customizing the characters. So that's actually pretty good. Even when you fail, you get something. I'm not really good with Little Mac. I feel like already abandoning him. Let's go with him one more time. I feel like we're going to do three characters and I'm kind of ready for the next one. Little Mac is a little bit too punchy for my, for my tastes. Send this bad boy flying. Oh, that was, see, that is an example of what not to do. That's what you don't want to do. It blew up before it even reached the structures. <laughs> there we go. We'll uppercut it. There. Oh, yes. Joshy likes what's going on here. Yes. Fall, 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 fall. Oh. That could have been good. That was almost good. Which is the most I can ask for in life. Almost good. All right, let's try one more character. Um, I'm, I think I'm going to go with, I think I got to go with him. We're going to go with, uh, Duck Hunt Dog. Let's do Duck Hunt Dog. Where is he? There he is. Um, so let's do Dalmatian Duck Hunt Dog. There he is. I feel good about this. 
little tips on the loading screen there. We, I mean, if you don't read Japanese, you can't read them, but obviously those will be translated. So even when you're waiting for the game to load up, you can still educate yourself. There we go. Duck Hunt Dog Show! No! Oh, man! I charged up way too long. So, yeah, like I said, I did that on purpose so you guys can see. He throws discs. He also calls, uh... Oh, wow, taking out the bottom. Keep falling, keep falling. All right, we're cleaning up some stuff here. Just got to go for the top. Oh, no, that was the second round. All right, we'll do one more round, guys, because I don't know how long you want to watch me and my pro skills here. Oh, that was not very good. It is, though, I'm telling you, like, there's, it's really good strategy to hit it up against that wall because that sucker bounces pretty high. Let's try that, in fact. We'll get the percentage up here. All right, let's bounce it up against the wall. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. No, 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 no. Okay, that, no, that was not my fault. We're, we're redoing, we're redoing. I, was not, I, get, I get too caught up in the fact that I'm actually playing as Duck Hunt Dog in a Smash Brothers game that I forget I'm supposed to hit the bomb. Here we go. No, no, no. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, the comments on this video are going to be very negative. It's okay, I only need one round anyway. It's like he's... Okay, I don't, Duck Hunt Dog won't send this flying. We're switching. We're switching characters. I'm not... I'm not yet professional at Duck Hunt Dog, and I don't want to end this on a sour note. We're going to switch characters. It's, it's like Charge Up wasn't sending it flying. I, probably because there wasn't enough percentage on the bomb. That's generally the problem. Lizardon is going to be uh, pretty good at this, I feel. I'm actually okay. I'm, I'm a little bit be better at Charizard. Again, these little modes are actually pretty darn addictive. So the bomb won't actually go flying until you get it past a certain percentage. Oh, that could be good, because it's going to blow that up. All right, so my next bit of strategy is going to be bounce it off the wall, get the top part. There we go. This could be good. I could redeem myself. Oh, it already blew up and got a decent amount. But you need to blow up a little bit sooner. All right, guys. Well, I could be playing this forever, but I hope you enjoyed the sneak peek at this brand new mode. It's pretty addictive. I'm not that skilled at it, but I'm sure you guys will do better. All right. Keep it here right at the bit block because we've got tons of Super Smash Brothers coverage coming out every day up until the Wii U release. So lots of smashing going on here. All right. I'll see you guys later.